Hello friends, welcome to Hop Info channel. From this video, you are going to understand about the work permit system PTW. Also, we're gonna explain it seven types of work permit systems. What is a work permit system? Permit to work systems PTW. It's a document procedure that authorizes certain people to carry out specific work within a specific time frame. It sets out the precautions required to the complete work safely based on a risk assessment. What is the content of the permit to work PTW? There are necessary content of every permit to work. This contents including bill of steps, the caption of the permit, the jobs to be done. When you finish your duty, you're gonna write down brief description of the job to be done, the inherent hazards in the jobs, corrective measure in place, location of the job, in which place you are going to work on it, time of the job, start time and end time. You're gonna mention it. Responsible persons, which person they take responsibility of that duty, the equipment or machinery involved, which types of equipment you're gonna involve it, emergency plans, signature, permit supervisor, and plan supervisor. You're gonna sign the permit and you're gonna close it. Types of permit to work, PTW types. There are several types of permit to work. Any types of job, they have a specific permit to work, PTW. So we're gonna explain seven common types of permit to work. Number one is general work permit, or you can say cold permit. This generally include the work in which no heat or spark will generate. The cold work permit typically blue heat, or the color of the cold permit is blue. The number two hot work permit. The hot work permit is usually taken to apply to the operation that could include the application of the heat or the ignition per present. It's typically colored red or the red each, or sometimes you can use the yellow color. Heights work permit or working at high permit. This types of permit authorization to work on elevated space two meter from the ground, be it ladders, scaffolds, mobile elevator work platform (MEWP) and the other space that are off the ground. Number four, confined space permit. A confined space entry, also referred as a vessel entry, they include any vessel, tank, container, pit, or any other similar space which has a very limited opening, which is not suitable to work for a longer time. And this in classes system give rise to the occurrence of an accident. The number five excavation work permit. This permit covers the authorizations for personnel to mine or dig land in order to build infrastructure, extract resources, or unearth hidden artifacts. Number six, electrical work permit. Electrical work permit is any work where the worker or the worker's fault will intentionally be in contact with electrically energized circuits. So while you're working with the electrical equipment or electricity, you are going to open that types of permit. The number seven chemical permit. This covers the authorizations to working with the harmful chemical substance or in a chemical induced atmosphere that is either toxic or corrosive by nature. So while you are dealing with the chemical substance, so you're gonna open that type of permit. Here we come to the end of the video. Do not forget to subscribe my channels. Until the another video, have a good times and bye.